Another Saturday Evening Post cover image that Dr. Myers has responded to in song is Bookkeeper Dreaming of Adventure, which was a June 7, 1924 cover illustration by Norman Rockwell. As you can see, a very diligent bookkeeper is at his desk dealing with his many tasks, papers surrounding him. But what he's really thinking about is someplace far away uh, where adventure might bring uh, a little bit of a break from his daily drudgery. The following week, Rockwell published a different perspective, which was uh, an image of a pirate dreaming of home. So with both of these covers, he was uh, referring to the fact that sometimes uh, we want the things that are a little bit out of our reach. Imagine the character sort of getting kind of sleepy at the repetitive activity and then um, sort of uh, a very distant sound and the, the soprano comes in, adventure, like a whisper almost, very high. Uh, and then uh, suddenly he's uh, in fully in this dream world. Then the stirring sounds, I have the guitar strumming very rapidly and, and then the chorus coming in really strong with the words adventure, adventure and the ship uh, is referenced to unfurl the sails and have a kind of imitative passage with the voices sort of bouncing that idea along and then coming back again we're going to unknown destinations and uh, so at that point I uh, created a few lyrics to sort of go along with the rhythm and to sort of drive the piece forward. And I think the singers have, they were immediately impacted in our first rehearsal by the strength of these contrasts. And the chorus and the singers are starting to get into, into how to make that sit in their voices and create a balanced and beautiful sound that can portray the bigness of this adventure. Um, very much fun is to put together those ahs in the middle uh, where John, to me they sounded almost like waves where he's, he made the reference to the expressionist, to Ravel maybe, uh, where the, the chorus goes in ahs and a, a wave-like motif. And so that's been another interesting factor to, to put, uh, put into the voices. Then eventually I have the uh the uh, original theme coming back in with a chorus really strong on the words adventure, adventure, and then that fades out, and then the tick-tock sound of the, of the uh, dream sequence comes back from the beginning. So this piece actually has a more kind of uh, circular uh, structure, so it starts out with a sort of falling asleep, repetitive tick-tock clock kind of sound or bell, uh, and then uh, and then these dream sequences.